got his ass cooked. He got cooked. Adrian, you didn't go down like that, huh? He got cooked. Adrian Broner lets Devin Haney and Bill Haney know that he wants the smoke. It's your boy, Mr. 926, a.k.a. Bushido the Dragon, a.k.a. the Black Mage, a.k.a. Captain Karate, a.k.a. I could do this all day, the two-time demonetized champion of the world. I need y'all to get the likes up, man. Get the likes up. Smash the like button. We have 350 people and 90 fucking five likes. Adrian, the problem, Broner, man. Long other days from the can, man, right? Y'all know your boy Bushido Rock with AB Heavy through the thick and through the thin. But if I'm honest, at this particular point, I think AB is past his prime. I think AB is since fallen down the hill and been since hit the bottom, right? Um, and now... Fast forward to today, he's calling out Devin the Dream Haney, who's pretty much one of the top fighters in the sport, one of the top young fighters in the sport of boxing. And now AB finds himself asking for a fight for Devin Haney. Ah, at Bill Haney, if you want to get your son at real Devin Haney effed up, send the contract. I ain't never ran from no man in boxing. Why would I run from your son? He can't punch himself out of a wet paper bag. Stop all the cap. Stop the cap. Because I'm with the shit. And I want all the smoke. Show me the dotted line. And then, of course, Bunny Easter is in the comment section. And speaking of Bunny Easter, I remember when Devin Haney first, first came on the scene. It was talking about a fight between those two dudes. I, Craig, my memory serves me crazy. It's been so long since those days when Devin Haney came on the scene and Adrian Broner was still somewhat doing his thing, right? He was still somewhat doing his thing, and he was trying to somewhat push a fight between Bunny Easter and you know, they was talking about fighting AB. AB was like, ah, he was scoffing at it because they was little dudes at the time. And now Devin Haney finds himself um, as one of the top fighters in the sport. He accomplished quite a bit in the sport, similar to Adrian Broner did when he was real young, similar to AB. Um, accomplished a lot in the sport. And now AB is looking for an opportunity. Now, Bill Haney reacts to this, right? Bill Haney catches wind of this. He reacts to it. You know, Bill Haney got a lot to say about everything. And, yeah, Bill Haney says this. AB might be the, a referee at Devin's fight, a judge, concession man, you know what I mean? Something, anything else but being in the ring with Deb, I guarantee you that. Wow. You can ask me. Ain't no money in the world. I got AB stopping his car and going the opposite direction if when he sees Devin with some boxing gloves on. Yeah. Wow. 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 I wonder why Bill somewhat dismissive of the Broner fight. I think that'll still somewhat be uh, an interesting fight and a good name to add to the resume, right? It, it, it won't. It won't hurt, right? It, it really won't hurt that type of fight. And then Bill has more stuff to say. Adrian, A B, Adrian, the problem Broner. What well, the real problem is, A.B., you put you versus Dev on your IG. So I hit you for the, out of respect for you and the boxing community in general. The message went on scene so you and I and everyone else knows what that means. A.B., you once represented the respect of boxing, the respect of the hood. Don't worry about it, A.B. We're going to take it over from here. It's the Devin Haney era. And you knew we was going to pull up. It's business. It's not personal. Get back to doing what you're doing, brother. And Devin is doing what he's doing. Representing this shit to the fullest. Y'all have a blessed day. On purpose. <laughs> wow. So, so Bill Haney basically said, look, man, you had your run. You had your fun. But we got it from here. Damn. So basically, AB, this this fight got shot down for Adrian Broner. I don't know, man. I I don't I don't see it being a AB will get up for that fight. AB will get up for the fight. I think AB will be in the best shape that we've seen in a long time. Um, it'll be a big moment, big opportunity for Broner. And maybe this is what Adrian Broner needs. 
it's simply just a big, big opportunity. But I mean, Avery Broner had so many opportunities. And me, even being a Brick Broner fan, you guys know I rock with AB through the thick and thin. Um, even though, um, I don't know, man. I don't know. I, the time outside of the ring, the, you know, AB can still fight, man. Let's not get it twisted now. AB can fight. He's never been no punk. He's never been no chump. Look at him. He's looking, he looking bigger now. He's getting older. He's getting bigger. He can still move, still do some shit. AB just probably needs a big fight to get motivated. Um, the fight with Devin will be a big fight. Um, I think it would be a good fight, man. I don't know. I don't know how you guys feel about it. Uh, I don't feel no particular way about it. I'm a fan of both dudes, and I would like to see Adrian Broner get one last big opportunity, and that's pretty much what this will be. But do he deserve one? I don't know, man. It's up to the Haney's. And Bill Haney pretty much said, look, man, we got it from here, man. Knock it off, you know. Stop the cap. And all this other stuff that you want to smoke and all this. So I don't know, man. I'm rooting for AB always, you know what I'm saying? But it's up to the, the Haney's if they want to entertain that fight. Now let's see what Devin – had to say if Devin said anything about this. Devin probably didn't say too much. Um, I know Devin in the past expressed interest in facing. Maybe this is what this is. Maybe this is why Bill is kind of dismissive of Haney, um, of AB now because of back when AB was kind of on top of things and, you know, still has some relevance in his name. Um, he was somewhat dismissive. I, if I'm not mistaken, I, I could sworn I we talked about it. Of course, we talked about some of everything over here, but. And nope. Uh. Nah, Devin didn't say anything about, as of right now, me making this video, Devin didn't say anything about Adrian Broner. So maybe this is not something that Devin is really looking forward to or interested in. Maybe it will be. I don't know. But Adrian Broner, man, he says that if you want your son to get effed up, you know what to call. I ain't running from no smoke, no duck, nobody. I'm Adrian, the problem. Broner, Bill Haney says, look, man, <laughs> sit your little butt down. We got it from here. Tell me what you guys think. Do AB deserve a fight with Devin the Dream Haney? Would it be a big fight for boxing? Will you be interested in seeing it? Like, subscribe, hot your boy. Peace out.